Hi guys, it's me, Jimmy Eric. Intel have just launched their 18 core processor, 18 core Xeon processor, which is called E7880. 90 basically, you can call 8890 V3 serial processor, but it's not frequency basically, it is a 18 core processor with 36 thread, which means 36 logical core in the window environment, but it's but it is costing a whopping amount of 7175 yes you heard me right it's a 18 core xeon processor with a 45 megabyte of l3 cache so it means 18 core 45 megabyte of l3 cache so it means 2.5 megabyte per l3 cache for individual core so this pro this processor is not for ever consumer like bill bob and jimmy but it is for the server room it is for the computation where you need to compute crunch big number mathematics stuff but most most properly this kind of processor always end up in the facebook twitter data center where they need a really big processor like 72 core, core processor which basically i did a video on if you don't believe me yes indeed yeah intel is launching their 72 core processor which is called intel xeon pi indeed it is a pi processor so basically it is only costing you 7000 7000 uh, basically it is only costing you 7175 sorry for a tongue tie and uh, i'm saying it's only costing you why i'm saying for the server room for a server room putting a 7000 dollar processor is still not expensive for putting in your desktop any processor above 500 i mean our heart start becoming uh, beaming so hard i mean wow one thousand dollar wow two thousand dollar processor so no no, no we, we can't for most of our time gamer like us we always invest the money on a graphic card in that case rather than buying a super high-end processor still now a lot of gamer always go for the i5 rather than going the i7 so for a seven thousand dollar processor still it's not expensive where they really need where they really need a processor for a good performance they where money is really matter more than time i mean Time is money so for example there is a, uh, normally what is called like a 8 core processor I mean 8 core processor we take one minute to do the computation for like uh, any social website social media website but when there is an 18 core processor which take less than one minute so of course I will buy a dozen of the 18 core processor just to make the lower time I mean in every today today day in age I give you my example I have so much stuff to do. I can't really answer all of the tech question. I can't make all of the videos every tech upcoming. So only I will decide which thing I can talk in front of the camera. That is called time. I mean, for me, time is really money. So picking up an 18 core processor really makes sense in a server room where time is really money, where you can do most of virtualization. I mean, 18 core processor is really awesome. I mean, for virtualization and then like in a web hosting company, you just I mean put an 18 core processor in a single server basically before uh, you can only host around 100 i mean website with the 18 core you can host i think 1000 website so i mean you just calculate all that kind of stuff i mean so 18 core processor is not expensive compared to what you will get in return i mean for example 100 website are hosted only on a 4 core or 8 core processor which is only bringing you for example like how much for uh, like 1000 dollar per month if you host 1000 website on an 18 core processor which can easily bring uh, you around ten thousand dollar per month so i mean you can you're too smart i mean ten thousand dollar minus a seven thousand dollar for, for first month you already get the the cost of the processor just in first month that's why this processor is super cheap compared to the needs for us it's freaking expensive for a server room for a data center for a university research lab seven thousand dollars and to be honest with this it's nothing seven thousand dollars is really nothing i will say so if any one of you listening if you are thinking to open a server room just pick up this processor i mean even intel have launched the 18 core lower end one so basically this intel 18 core is having a 45 megabyte of l3 cache with 3.3 gigahertz of turbo clock speed and then with uh, uh, with the 2.5 mb uh, per l3 cache and then it's having the two point i forgot the base clock speed i think 2.2.7 is the base clock speed with 3.3 is the 
yes 2.5 is the base clock speed with 2. Point, to be 3.3 that turbo clock speed so the base clock speed is really to be on a slow i mean the more core you implement in a processor the less base speed you will get i mean nowadays base speed should be around 4 gigahertz but still it's 2.5 so yeah i will just say i'm just including the link of the story i mean in the description box below you can do your research you can read more about it if you are thinking to buy but it will not like you can just pick up from your direct by what is called best buy walmart or any kind of computer center you have to basically try to find a distribution channel to pick up these processors are not made for consumer these are made for server room lab that's all subscribe to my channel it's me jimmy again today i don't know why i'm having some tongue type problem i think i'm having a sore throat anyway subscribe to my channel it's me jimmy bye bye